maybe? Possibly. Not sure. Up. Oh, up. Oh, okay. I think we're good. Okay. Hello, I'm Tau BMS, and I am here playing Space Fox Kimi, a game made by Shenzhou, which is a friend of mine. And, oh, yeah, no problem. Um, okay. So, hopefully it sounds... Is the audio okay? Is is my voice okay? Is it too loud? Too quiet? Is the game too loud? Too quiet? That sort of stuff. Because I noticed that my voice is a little bit peaking a little bit beyond this. So, okay. If, if you think it's, like, running perfectly fine, then I will just get right into it. Because I've actually been kind of curious about this game, and I've been holding myself back specifically for this, so. Chapter 1. Space Deck uh, ah! Space Cadet Kimi. Aboard the Galactic Foxian Empire sca Carrier, Barry Ascension. Right, all set. This is it. Your big day. Kimi, hurry up. It's almost time. Coming, Mom. Okay, doing voices is weird, but not well. There you are. Are you ready to go? Yep, I double checked and triple checked everything. Good. You can never be too careful when going out into the field. You got everything you need then? Did you have a chance to eat yet? I'm sure you'll have time to stop by the cafe cafeteria. Please, Mom, you worry too much. I'll stop by to pick up something for the ride down. Of course I'm worried. It's your first time leaving the ship. My first town's pretty dangerous. Yours probably will be too. Yeah, it won't be that bad. My instructor will be there along with the other cadets. She'll be fine. We taught her well. Besides, she's nearly 15. Can't dote on her forever. <sighs> you can't just let me be the doting mother, can you? But you're right. Good luck out there, Kimi. Tell us about when you get home. Okay. So, this is an RPG maker game. It, it seems like very, um... I notice there's like some exploration aspects and such, so... I, I'm gonna try and like take as much time to decide, to like check locations and like poke around things so personally I keep mo most of my stuff here though there isn't really anything I need for the trip wait what's us got a GFE MRE I completely forgot about this is this stuff is this still edible okay so I think that's a healing item yeah it's a healing item it's food it's food basically Finally, the GFE Mo Maputahu, Maputahu has departed for the Kepler, Kepler system. It is our hope they will secure a new ho hunting ground for the fleet. We wish them the best of luck. And, the latest and that is the latest news in the Galactic Foxian Empire. Thank you for watching. Okay, so let's, can I go in these rooms? My bathroom, but I've already done everything I need to do. Okay. Mom and Dad's room, I have no business there. Uh, can't really interact with these. Uh, I guess these are like walls. They, they look like they could be doors, though, admittedly. Maybe I'll find some change in the couch? Nope, okay. Uh, these look like they're doors! <laughs> Every fox has their duty to the Empire. Remember to do yours. My neighbor lives here, but I shouldn't bother them right now. Okay. Canteen. Oh, yeah, I had to stop by here. Also, weird thing I noticed during, like, a little test fight trip, you can control this game with a mouse, which is surprising, to say the least. Most RPG Maker games, I notice, don't really have some stuff like this. ID, please. Here you are. Let's see. Keep me right. It says here you haven't gotten your midday ration yet. Here you are. Wait, there's change in the bed. Yes! I knew there would be change in some sort of f furniture. So expensive. Well, once you graduate from being a cadet, you'll be paid more, and your meal portions will increase as well. I kind of just started skipping through stuff, because I did play a little bit of the beginning of this game, but I have never gone outside of the actual, like, station itself. So, I think I can, uh, sprint. Okay, yeah. Alright, so, back to the bedroom. Uh, table standard for each bedroom, but I never use mine. 
If I wanted to use my di digipad, I just lay on my bed. Uh, let's see, uniform, uniform, uniform. Oh, more uniforms. Sometimes I wish that we had more variety in the clothes. Bed? Not the most comfortable, but that's living in space for you. Comfort's not exactly top priority around here. Oh, okay, so she had, like, money out. Sleeping on money is good luck. Well, personally, I just keep it for emergencies. I suppose this counts. Well, we are leaving this shit. And, you know, that, that makes sense. Let's talk with the people in the canteen. Eddie, please, here you are. Let's see, you've already gotten your midday ration, Kimi. If you want to get but more, you can buy extra portions from the terminal to your right. Hi, Kimi, here for your rations? Yep, gotta eat up before going planet side. Oh, right, it's your first mission today, right? Let's see. Looks like you've already gotten your midday ration, Kimi. But here's something a little extra, just for you. Got an energy drink. Ooh, thanks, Marie. You're welcome. Good luck today. Hey, lucky. Okay, let's actually see that real quick. So, okay, so that's MP. Nice. Uh, the same slop again. I want to go on a hunting mission again. At least we can eat what we catch. Not very appealing, but at least it's filling. Makes sense. My next mission has me leaving the fleet for a few weeks. They don't really account for getting bored when they give you supplies for a mission. So I had to spend a good portion of my credits on quality MREs and holovids. I wish they'd reimburse me at least a little bit. Singularity can fit containment field is still operating at 18% efficiency. There's still too much deviation from the containment field. We need to find a different way. Sounds like he's working on something serious. I should leave him alone. I don't know why I'm giving him, like, a, a giving Kimi a, a vague Ruby Rose voice, but, eh, whatever. Why are you just standing there? Help me find it. Okay, okay, let me just finish my meal. <sighs> Fine, but you always eat so slow. It's important to eat properly, you know? Okay, so not much I could get out of that, I don't think. But actually, can I read this data pad? Please don't touch that. Uh, sorry. Like a vending machine? Actually, the Black Oxygen Empire's acquisitions terminal. Please consume in moderation to ensure the continued prosperity of the fleets. Okay, so that's like healing item, slightly better healing item. MP item. Okay. I can't sell because it's a vending machine. Alright. Uh, there you are, Kimi. Cadet Kimi reporting for duty, ma'am. Oh, did I... I wasn't sure. Okay. Good. You're the last one. We're just about to finish it. We just about finished takeoff preparations. Go ahead and make sure you're ready. Once you are, come talk to me. Okay, let's talk to literally everyone. I get it if some of the pilots want to take care of their ships themselves. But it'd be nice if they were at least good at it. Makes us mechanics look bad if anything goes wrong. Can I actually look at this? Better bad? This is what the lady at the canteen was talking about? I'll just... Oh! Oh, side quest! Kind of, sort of, ish. Hi! Excuse me, were you looking for this? My digipad, thank you. If only my boyfriend was as helpful as you are. I was going to help. Sure, after you finally finish eating. Thank you for bringing this back to me. Here, take this. 200 credits. Nice. Uh, should I pick up an extra healing? Like, I, I, I'm thinking about maybe picking up the, uh, quality MRE, but, eh. I already have two regular ones, and I'm not sure how much they'll actually heal. So, yeah. I'll, I'll keep it at that for now. Have some credits for later, at least, in case we have to, like, buy weapons or something like that. It's a beacon probe. It's sent to locations where we don't have a jump beacon, so the other ships can jump there. I think it also does something else. Can't remember, though. 
I'll have to review it before the test. It is a status to play for display for the ship. They always kept fueled and armed just in case they need they need to be scrambled. That's what I thought that you. Yeah, I do a good job of taking care of the ships. But I only trust myself with my ship. She's like an extension of me after all. Can I look at the ship? The Mantis is a class of salt craft. It's primarily used as a troop transport, but when necessary, it can also be used as it can also be a close support craft. If I can remember this much, I should be good for the written exam. What about these? Current class interceptor, primarily used to achieve superiority over enemies and clear away the blockers. Older class of ship, but I hear R and D is coming up with a new one. Boxes full of tools and supplies. There's nothing useful for me here. Much I should be looting stuff from other people. And let's talk to these guys. Hey, Kimi. Looking forward to the mission? You bet, Gene. I've been training for this all for this day for the longest time, after all. You guys ever, ever aren't you? Shouldn't you be at least a little bit nervous about your first mission? No way! I've been looking forward to this for a long time. <laughs> That's so like you. Maybe once we land, we can team up for the mission. Sounds good. I'll come find you then. First mission. wonder what the planet will be like. I'm sure we can handle whatever we find down there. Even if the mission is live fire, I usually don't send cadets on really dangerous missions. Honestly, I'm a bit nervous. Why are you so calm, Kimi? Come on, we've been training for this for the longest time. We got this. I wish I could be as confident as you. Just going already. I'm bored just standing around here. Okay. Ready to go. Remember, we won't be coming back anytime soon. I don't think I missed anything. So, yeah. All right, let's go. Hold on, I'm gonna take a drink. All right, so this is the mission. For your first live fire mission, you'll be raiding a village of natives. We are vastly superior to them when it comes to technology, but that's not the point. This mission is for you to practice tactics and fighting on the battlefield for real. For that reason, you'll be restricted to, ba to the battle stand. Ah, ah, I can't speak. You'll be restricted to standard shoot blasters, blasters and batons. That way, you can't count on our technological advantage and have to rely on your own skills and abilities. I'll provide guidance and advice along the way. Oh crap! I skipped it. Ah. Oh well. Everyone, gear up and prepare to go. I think you're saying. Ah. When I do that, it's so annoying. Oh. Uh, I've been making this a career. So start making an RPG in my back. I hope. I, I would like to see it. That would be kind of cool. Got a cadet blaster and a cadet baton. Don't forget to equip them, of course. Like, I mean, I, I'm not really sure if there's, like, a distinct difference between ranged weapons and melee weapons. But I, I assume, like, ranged weapons would be less powerful than melee, like, over in overall full damage. Or maybe more powerful but less accurate, but I'm not sure. Then again, I could, I could just be, like, overthinking it. I'll just go with them. Okay. Raid, huh? It's very training we've been through. I'm pretty confident in our odds. You should be careful still. Underestimating the enemies could get us killed. Oh, so some skills are weapon class specific. Okay. That, that's good to know. Speaking of which, do you want to team up? Yes! Make sure there's nothing else we need to do. We have, we'll head out soon. Somehow this is more normal than I expected. I mean, it's nice to finally get off the ship, but the. But I thought the plan would look more exotic. Uh, we can do this. Uh, if I 
using some primitives, huh? Isn't primitives spelled differently? I could be wrong. Well, can't we have something more challenging? Uh, and you. Now that I'm here, I sort of wish I was back on the ship. Oh, shit. Uh, let's interact with this. My trusty digipad. Maybe I should write my, my journal before moving on. Yes, save. Yes, please. Thank you. Anything else I can mess with? MRE. Make sure there's nothing else you need. We head out soon. Just head this way. I like the music. With an axe here. Probably left by the locals. Should I take it? Yeah, sure. Does that actually count as a weapon? Nah. Uh, so that's just like a basic item. Like a key item, I guess. Alright. A grave. I can't beat the inscription, but it's clear that it was made with care. There's even a memento here. There's someone camped out here at some point. Okay, well, actually, since she's using the blaster, I'm gonna give Kimi the, uh, the baton, since that would actually give a bit of, um, skill variety. Wait up. Looks like we have some hostiles. There's only two of them, though. We can easily take them out. Starting a fight right now might not be the best idea, though. Maybe we can find another way around? Okay, so there probably is another path I'm I'm not seeing. Right up shrub here blocking the path. Oh, I can use sex to get out of it. And that's that. The way's clear. Okay. Simple, simple puzzle solving. I like that. Looks like there's a hidden path here. We can use this to sneak back to the past patrol. Job. I can avoid getting into a fight before we're ready. But it's less interesting this way. Better boring and alive than interesting and dead, Kimi. Fine, fine. 500 experience for that. Okay. Level 4. Damn, that was a jump. Hmm. Wait. Ambush. Oh, that is a lot. We need to fight back. Jean. Right. Okay, battle system. I mean, it doesn't look too bad, actually. Oh, I'm probably going to for a bit. And this would be, like, multi-hit. Okay. Let's try doing basic damage, see how much we do. And I believe... You would be. You, you can do rapid shot on this guy. Okay, so that's like generally slightly more damage as long as all the hits hit. And holy oh shit, you take a lot of damage fast. Okay, I'm gonna stun one of them. And you are gonna heal Kimi. Oh, that's like a long-lasting stun, too. Damn. Okay, so like... Oh, wait, okay, so never mind. It, it went down one the moment the uh, turn ended. Uh, yeah, okay, let's go. Let's get uh, two attacks on this guy. See if we can... Uh, down a little bit. Had really low TP, but... Oh, yeah, well... I guess energy is used for more to support skills, and TP is used for the damaging skills. Stun 
and him, keep him out of the fight, and... Oh, TP restores. Okay, that's cool. Dead on Gene, and Gene can do damage. Oh wow, the gun does significantly more damage. Okay, that that's good to mind at least. Um, I'm just gonna real quick have them both attack because I think we have one last barrage. I think Soldier B should be down. Except never mind, miss. Okay, now he should be down. There we go, okay. Uh, okay. Let's stun him real quick and uh, should be able to finish him off in like a turn or two. Oh, okay, his, his stun's lasting longer now. I, I'm not sure why. Uh, I guess it's like a chance of it lasting longer than normal. That that'd be kinda cool. Uh real quick, just gonna heal yourself a little bit. Rapid shot. Okay. I think we got this. Yep. King's party was victorious. 400 experience. Level 5, level 5. No new skills. There are too many. Kimi, we can't stay here. We need to fall back for now. And... Oh, yeah, that's a bad situation. And, oh, everything's dead. It's all burning. Really underestimated them. How will we get home now? Even if we survive, there's no rescue coming. We for failures in the fleet. Now when resources are tough tough as it is, tight as it is. Bleh, I can't speak. There has to be something we can do. Can't we set up a distress beacon or something? I doubt we can salvage any equipment from the flames. Be lucky to save anything useful at all. No. I don't want to die here. Oh, no. no. We're not going to die here. We need to get out of here first. Whoever's at this fire might still be nearby. Wait, should we try to salvage anything useful from the wreck? We're going to survive this way. We might need all the help we can get. Good idea. Let's see what we can salvage. So... Energy drink. Quality MRE. Not sure I can get that last one. One MRE, and I think I've got enough for now. Okay. I'm not, I think I got all of them, but I'm not sure. First of all, we need to see if the others are still alive. If they are, we can't just leave them behind. Hell, there's only three of us, and who knows how many of them. If we hit them now, and we hit them hard, and we'll be expecting another attack so soon. Since her love you. Bleah. Chances are they'll be busy celebrating their victory. Or they might be busy playing up new weapons. Though that might actually be more dangerous. Crazy key. That's, there's no way that'll work. Sit here and wait then. I'm going wherever you're helping or not. I'm going with you. I can't let you do this alone. Thanks, Gene. I knew I could count on you. Get ready. We'll head out soon. Okay. Sam, a bit worthy to worry about this stuff. You did come up with a pretty bold plan there. Do you think we have a chance? Who knows? But I do know your plan is probably our best bet. I'm ready when you are. Let's go. We got anything on here? Today didn't really go as I'd hoped. Can't let it get me down though. We could, we could take a quick drink to make a journal entry. Yep. I also really like the music. The music's nice. I dig it. Sorry about the bit harsh there, Kimi, but that but that really is a crazy plan. Oh, it's raining. See if I can I'll see if I can salvage anything from the ship. Maybe there's a working comms beacon we can sing the little fleet with. Ah, 
Maybe. Uh, I'm turning back now. Hmm? I smell some beasts around here. Be careful. And by be careful, I mean fight them. Maybe. Okay. So I, I was thinking maybe if I snuck up on it, I would have gotten like a um a taken by surprise sort of thing. Nope. No. All right. That's fine. Oh, okay, that is significantly more damage. Oh no, it's fine. I, I guess it would be pretty difficult to code, especially if it's like, um... If it's like you don't... I'm not sure if they actually have models that have like turned around like looks and such. I guess it's like, um... I guess you could do like directional input stuff for like if you do it from this angle or something like that. It would be like, oh okay, you get this sort of bonus and like a little text box. But then again, I don't really know coding that well, so maybe that's just me being very, like, I'm probably just oversimplifying it. Legless creature, that totally is not a snake, yes. Though I guess if this is like a, um, a completely new planet to them, they probably wouldn't know. So, that makes sense. Oh, they got poison. Hopefully it actually doesn't poison. Uh, chance based on your agility? Okay. Oh, did that actually escape in status? Okay. Okay. That's Do some big damage. Stun him and get him out of the way. Nice. Level 6. Thundering Strike and Spread Shot. Okay. Uh, let's look at those real quick. I'm gonna assume that these are like more AP. Uh... Strikes target lowers defense. That seems useful. Oh, okay. So it's like a multi-hit one, like random enemies. That that's that's nice. Okay. like that's good. Okay, that's a spread shot. Oh, that's fast. Okay, I like that. I like the fast animation. Like it like suddenly just showing the damage instead of just like doing it like, oh, one at a time, one at a time, one at a time. Because that, that's always kind of a pet peeve for me. So I, I dig that. That's nice. Let's go for you as well. Sorry if I'm like grinding too much. I just, I'm kind of just getting used to the battle system, I guess. I kind of do that sometimes. Eight like a creature. Build up some PP first. But I think he should be able to pull that one without issue. Stun me. Okay, so Jean obviously has more speed, so I, I I gotta like focus on like Okay, so I think it's like allies first uh, and enemies first and then it's based on like I mean, let me see, is there like a speed stat? Okay, there's an agility stat and okay. I, I'm actually kinda wondering if it's based on like agility alone or if it's ally agility, then enemy agility. That's that's what I'm wondering. 
I don't know, maybe I think about this sort of like stat stuff too uh, too much. Oh, uh, I can win without the grind. Okay. Oh wow, you are barely alive. Level seven, level seven. I don't know, I guess I'm like weird in that I li I really like to see um all that I can see in a game, like in terms of like stats and levels and stuff like that. Which, I mean, I guess that's a, a bit of a weird thing, but not really. It, it's hard to explain. Stun you. And rapid shot, I guess would be good. Oh, okay, so that was a lot of damage. I think we're starting to, like, do significantly more damage now. No, I mean, like, um... Not just in terms of, like, stats... In terms of like uh, unlockable abilities and such, you know, like in like these classical style turn-based RPGs, I love like seeing new abilities and such. That's like a big thing for me. It's like the fastest factor in a sense. You know what I mean? Uh, let's first aid for. Actually, I shouldn't spend too much. So I'll, I'll first aid for Jean, and Jean can wreck shot again. Like that's like the main thing that I like seeing in like RPGs and such and I, I'm not really sure like how many skills you have in this game but if there's like an abundance for like different scenarios and such I can take that that's that's fine uh, I can probably like slip down here I was kind of half expecting to click on this and be like oh hey I can chop through this oh Okay, so I just got, like, okay, so that, the other side was, like, the other entrance was, like, a, um, that was, like, the straight-up entrance to their village. They seem human. At least from their, like, sprites. Looks like I was wrong. There are still some people on the guard. It's a stench even in this rain. Maybe there are other ways to get in without a direct fight. A uh, fight would definitely draw attention. We should make sure we have no other option to, before attacking head on. Let's see, can we head this way? Can't leave yet. That just the compound. Okay. Probably is a way. Just not seeing it. Can I go through there? Not really. No. Okay. I kind of do want to see if I can get like do like sort of stealth runs or like not really a stealth run, but like a stealth cho stealthy more like. Passive, passive choice sort of run type thing. And hi! <coughs> nice. Give me compound. Walls aren't too tall. You can probably climb up the hell of this tree. Sure will be walking in the front door, that's for sure. Climb the wall, yes! <coughs> Kimi is now level 8. John is now level 8. Rin, we should be careful here. There's no way we can fight without drawing attention. Okay, never mind, that is not stealth. Trip Motu. Okay, that is significantly less stealthy, but we found our allies. Okay, we're good. Uh, stun you. And attack you. Kind of spreading out the damage, which is not exactly what I prefer. Keep doing the plan a little bit. Go ahead and deal with the damage to you. I'll save that for later. I'm gonna try and sunder the other guard in a moment. Actually, I should heal Jean, or Jean. I keep saying, I keep on picking Jean because Bayonetta. Like, did I just... 
Oh, I accidentally pressed the... I accidentally pressed the right while scratching my nose, and I fucked up. God damn it. Alright. Uh, Sundering and... Rapid Fire. I actually, honestly, I probably should have Kimi with the gun. Because, um... Jean seems to have a set... Like, she, since she's got the higher speed, she would be doing the status effect first, and then, like, Kimi would do the big damage. So that, that should probably be what I... And that is an item there. Ooh. You guys are okay. Kimi, what are you doing here? Saving you guys, duh. Should be a key somewhere. I'll look around for one. Okay. I'm gonna real quick just... Swap to the blaster. Swap to the baton. Oh! One moment, I need to look at this now. Okay, general... Oh! I love it! Okay, so if there's one thing I really like, it's like going like super in-depth in the stats. And I did not know it went like this like... Okay, I didn't know we'd get like full-on parameters and like minor like stats and such like that. So it is like, um... So I'm assuming it's either like Fire Emblem or something else. Where essentially you'd have a each level would have a chance of increasing that stat, that particular stat. Hit rate, evasion rate, evasion crit, magic evasion, magic reflect, counter. Oh wow, there's a lot floor damage. Okay, so I need to keep my eye on that. Aggro rate. Okay, you had me at aggro rate. <laughs> Uh, you don't utilize, uh, the parameters, I guess? That's fine. First things first. Chest. Keep the weapons, could be useful. Standard issue blaster and medical serum. Ooh. Yes, please. Oh, that is a big boost. Like, okay, so, without them, you lose... Okay, without a weapon, you lose, like, almost all your damage, so... Like, that's, like, a solid ch chunk. What's this? Prison key. Guard this to drop it during fight. Now to unlock the cell. Real quick, I'm just gonna see if he has anything on him. How about you? Anything in here? Some kind of fruity drink. Maybe just a taste. HP and SP as it works out. Alright. Tasting now, but I do feel a bit woozy. Shouldn't drink too much, it might be alcoholic. Sacks of plaster. This combat must have been pre built pretty recently, but stuff like this is still laying around. It's like a ledger of some sort. Can't read it though. Oh, look, at there's a key in here. Can I take their weapons? Oh! Maybe I can take one as a souvenir. Keep me focused on the task at hand. I'm still in the fucking prison. Move key here, kind of move on. Can I check here? See what's in these drawers, more papers, some trinkets, and... Ooh, be scanty. Can I keep it for later? I'm... Okay, that recovers my HP, okay. Probably should have saved that. Spare water. Okay, that's what I'm looking for. Just keep this trick, bingo. Good job getting us out of there, Kimi. You too, Jane. Officially, I'm supposed to chastise you for coming back for us. Uh, personally, I'm glad you did. Are we supposed to just leave our comrades behind? Now's not the time for that. What's the situation? We managed to sneak in undetected, but the compound is well guarded. Now, though now that we're all here, I think we should be able to take it over. Afraid not. Most of us are still wounded from the ambush earlier. What about the ship? The natives set fire to it. As far as I can tell, it's unflyable. Kato is trying to see if it can salvage Calm Beacons, Calm Beacons Bell. If anyone can do it, if anyone can do it in our class, it's him. 
good. I'd hate to spend the rest of my life here. And so, what should we do now, ma'am? It's up to you two now. We could take out their leader, maybe we can get them the route. Then we can slip into the forest and hide out until they we can kind of have the fleet. Just the two of us, ma'am? Come this far. I have faith in you. We'll try and patch ourselves up and head back and back you up when we can. I think I was able to save my cameras, now all that's left is to kill the local commander. Maybe I should write up something, just in case. And yes. Can I recruit you? Damn. Can I recruit you? Well then exact. I wanna get ambushed ever again. Can I recruit you? Thanks for saving us. Here, take dip. Woo! Nez must have missed it while searching us, you'll definitely make better use of it than we will. Actually, now I think about it. Okay, yeah, so. What does the stimulant do? Medical serum. This is status abnormal status effects. Can't restore the HP stimulant. Serum to revive unconscious people. So I, I would assume that's for, like, um. To revive, like. Like, dead allies, essentially. Some battles here, nothing special about them. Okay. Kind of saw that coming, I guess, but not at all. Teeth. Mm. Okay, so, enemy here. That's not fun. Uh, look. Well, at least it won't be fun if he calls the rest of them, so let's just kick his ass. Yes, it's working perfectly. Holy <laughs> shit, that laser. That is significantly more damage. Uh, better off not spending too much TV. I'll, I'll just do the attacks. God damn! That thing fucking wrecks house! We're fighting our way. Oh. Well, shit, okay. <laughs> and speaking of fighting, unless we have to, we have to. Fuck. Okay, so I think I have like um, it's like a weird thing where like they have starting TP. If that makes sense. Yeah, you know about the fuck, it's over a hundred, damn. Okay, so, stun. Come on, this one. Okay, if I'm being completely honest, I love this music. <laughs> Done off. And. Yeah. I think. Nah, we're probably not gonna call this time. Yeah, no. Uh, this time. Yeah, stealth did not work out at all. Can we get a key off of him? Nope. Can I like sneak in and to this room? Oh, what the fuck? A picture of but a book full of pictures of strange looking creatures. Bipedal creature of a long snout and horns. Made of female but with wings. Maybe this is a book documenting the creatures they encountered. There's an incomplete drawing of us. Is that really what they think we look like? These aren't very big, are they? Lots of books, can't read. Not alone. Just make sure I'm ready for battle before confronting him. I'm gonna do that. Okay, stealth ain't working out. Let's just go ahead and just beat him up. Miquet, Krivatoya, Potuya. 
I am attempting and failing to speak words. They, they look like general, like, basic RPG classes. Which, I'm assuming that's what you, that's what you were going for. So... I'm just gonna go ahead and real quick, uh... uh take out the, these guys first. Once I get the chance, I'm gonna probably stun the commander. Because he's probably ever gonna stat buff or okay magic. Yeah, I saw I saw that coming, I guess. Let's uh, yeah, I think I'll stun her. Let's just go ahead and take her out of the equation. Yeah, I'll try and take her out, because she's going to be an issue. Heal up Kimi. Because she's our big damage dealer right now. And Jean is also really, really low on health. So, I'm just going to... There we go. Healing. Lots of damage. That is certainly not a normal attack, but okay. Yeah, the commander doesn't seem to be doing any different like attacks compared to the others, so. He's probably just more powerful. Damn it! Okay, TP increases as I take damage. Oh god, yeah, he is more powerful. Alright. Okay, first aid. Let's, let's just heal, please. Fuck. Oh, that's useful. Oh, she's a healer, too. Well, fuck you, too. Damage, big damage, big damage. Ah, oh, damn it, just short. I'm getting low again. Uh, go ahead and stun the commander. He's the big damager. And he's getting that. Okay, yeah, we need to heal Kimi. Hit the rapid shot on this dick. And. Big first aid. If I'm being completely honest, I feel like, um. In terms of how much damage I'm taking, in proportion to how much I'm healing with first aid plus. I feel kind of like first aid original is kind of outdated before I even get to touch it. Considering I get it like right after my, I think like right after my first, technically e even before my first battle in this case. Because I snuck past my first battle and got experience for it. So, I, I don't know, maybe it's just me. But, um... It doesn't really seem as useful when, in comparison to how much, considering how much damage I'm taking currently, in like comparison to, I guess the proportions of how much, like first aid one could heal in comparison to how much first aid plus can heal, and how much it's helping me right now. It's like what's like unless it's like. I don't know. Maybe I'm just not really fit. Maybe I'm thinking about it too hard. I just... I guess it just seems kind of not as useful now, even though I've never really got the chance to use it. And, oh, sweet Jesus. Uh, stun? Please? Please. 
Yes! Sunder him. Yeah, he is a he is a very dodgy bastard. Okay. Let's do rapid fire again. And see if we can stun him again. Okay, yeah, it is very easy to like stun lock, I feel like, then. But, like considering how long it Like I I'm I'm sorry if I'm looking at this at like the critical standpoint. I guess it just seems like it, it's like something that can be easily abused. And I'm gonna try not to, but at the same time it's like, you know, it's there. Oh, that was a crit, I think. I think it flashed red a little bit. Okay, no longer stunned. I think if we're if we're lucky, we should be able to end this now. God fucking damn it. Please? Yes! I, it's not really so much that it's like a really, like, it's just something I noticed that, like, I don't know, maybe enemies could use, like, a, like um, after a, like, certain amount of time under stuff. You could, you could probably invoke, like, that sort of uh, status effect. Where, essentially, enemies, after being stunned, gain a temporary resistance to stunning damage, to stun status effects. That's okay, takes care of that. Let's hope things work out. Commander dead, the remaining soldiers fled the compound. Kiwi and her comrades use the opportunity to slip into the woods and return to the landing site. Luckily, Kato was able to salvage enough, salvage enough parts to repair a comms beacon, and with it, they were able to contact the fleet. Dropshot was dispatched, quick pick up the group, and they were returned to the fleet. So, I learned what you did down in Glees. Glees at Glees Delta. I think that's how you pronounce it, Glees? You know what our policy is, don't you? Survival of the fleet is precedent. Those who fall in battle are to be left behind unless recovering them does not endanger the survivors. Yes. And yet you led an assault on the enemy compounds to rescue your comrades. On your own. Yes, sir. Kimi, you are hereby sentenced to two weeks of menial labor. But, sir, I... The rules are clear. You have to follow them to maintain order in the fleet. But... You are to be commended for your bravery and initiative. Once you serve your sentence, I am recommending you for officer training. Sir! Don't get complacent. There's still lots of eyes on you. Don't let us down. I won't. Thank you, sir. Good. Starting your sentence tomorrow. This must. That was a thing. Let us down, Kimi. Remember your duty to the Empire. Can I steal his shit? And now an update on the Mapo Tahu mission. The Mapu Tahu arrived at its destination earlier today. Initial reports show favorable climates for habitation and a large supply of prey animals. We expect samples of their harvest to arrive in the uh, arrive in the fleet in the coming days. That's it for news today. Thank you for watching. Good night. Uh, console, I shall leave it alone. Console, I shall leave it alone. Except the captain's journal. I wonder why he doesn't just use a, a digipad. I know the smell. It's the fruity smelling drink I found on the mission. Let's well, see, the mission got some cool stuff for the fleet. Eh, those are the captain's personal belongings. Collection of books. Or so. They're all in some alien language. Can the captain read them? All some sort of artifacts from different civilizations. I'm not too interested in them, but I guess the captain is. Really fancy cabinet. Definitely wasn't built on board. Probably take it from some alien civilization. I was surprised to hear what you did, Kitty. I knew I know you were firing one, but dear. I'm just glad you're safe. Let's wait there for a moment. Congratulations, Kimi. Thanks, Mom. 
and out we go. Ready to go home? Yes. Yep, let's go. Chapter 2, the Mapotahu Incident. That's interesting considering we, we've been I've been reading about it now since like the beginning before I went on to the mission. The several months of training. Another long-winded lecture. Times like this, I wish I had become an officer. I wonder how Jane's doing. Speak of the devil, Jane. Kimi. It's been a while. Let's catch up over lunch. Sure, I have some time before my next deployment. Let's go. So how are things in the Marines? Oh, it's rarely a dull moment, that's for sure. More often than not, we're fighting whatever enemies we run into. And we certainly run into a lot of them. Wish my training could be like that. All I've done was sit here for here is sit through lectures and run simulations. Sounds like you're getting your decision to be an officer, Kimi. Oh, sometimes the life of a marine is really hard, you know. It's scary to be on the front lines. You never know whether or not your next step will be our last. Well, that's true. But it still sounds better than just sitting around and attending lectures. Maybe we should swap roles for a while and see how we like it. I'm up for that. Of course, the higher-ups would. U.S. squad, report to ha Hangar C for pre-deployment briefing and preparations. Looks like we're out of time. I have to go now. Off on another mission already. Where are you going this time? Sorry, I'm not allowed to say. We'll talk more next time, okay? There's been a lot of classified missions lately. Despite being an officer, they haven't told me anything. I guess it's because I'm still in training. I hope everything's okay, though. I don't have anything else I need to do, to do today. Maybe I'll just head home. Can I eat? These are officer meals spread and fast. I'd still rather not go back to the cadet stuff, though. Did you get hurt in officer meals? What? Payment has approved, but still not enough. At this rate, we may be away. The deadline's coming up. Still working on the same project. It's been months! Please don't touch it. Yep, okay, he doesn't want me touching his food. ID, please, here you are. Let's see, you've already gotten your midday rations. There's a train going, has its ups and downs. Pardon me? Well, sometimes that's just how life is. I guess you're here for a lunch. Let's see, you've already gotten your midday rations. But here's something a little extra. Yeah. You're welcome, cheer up, your things will look up soon. I should get her something sometime. It was really good to me since I was a kid. Can I get more stuff here? Nope. I mean, I kind of just... I tried to conserve as many items as I could while down there. I feel like I did a pretty good job of it. Talk to you. <sighs> I have to buy a new uniform, but I already spent all my wage. Darn you expensive snacks. I'm just glad it's not my squad being sent out this time. I've already been on the plane for too long. I just need a break from my boss. We're close to a deadline, so he's constantly making us pull all nighters. Can I go into the neighbor's house now? Oh my god, I can! Oh yeah, I got paid recently. Now might be a good time to stock up on stuff. Oh! Okay, first thing first. What's this? No idea. Every fox is due to the Empire, blah blah blah. Various guns and display pieces. Means have access to a larger, larger selection of buttons. Okay. Welcome to the armory. Okay. Ooh! Okay, let's see here. Targeting visor includes these exact accuracy. Uh, standard issue blaster, we already got one of those. And, oh, okay. A sort of a superheated blade designed to cut through flesh and metal, usually used by GFE Marines. I'm gonna pick that up, and I'm also gonna get a targeting visor. A targeting visor. Remember, do your duty to the Empire. 
until we get a another ally, I'm gonna swap to the Heat Sword because having an ability to like debuff and stun would be very useful. Not the same hallway as outside of King's Park. Oh, okay, I wasn't sure. I'm sorry. I, it th they look very similar, admittedly. Okay, so this is like genuinely lower defense. Targeting system. This accuracy and also apparently agility. Hmm. Oh damn, that does increase my accuracy. Holy shit. Okay, that went up from like that like twenty percent accuracy boost. That's that's not too bad. Can I go in these still? Nope, okay. It's been two months since our last contact with Mapotahu. Their last communication shows nothing out of the ordinary. We're currently investigating the situation. We'll provide updates as the information becomes available. That's all the news we have at the moment. Thanks for watching. Alright, let's check into here. This is my classroom. I have no business here. Neighbor's house. Damn it. <laughs> haven't seen them around lately. That's it for me. Time to call today. Yep. I'll just hang out at home for the rest of the day. A few days later. Give me a status report. All systems nominal, man. Green across the board. Good, good. Time to our destination. We're just about there. Arriving in three, two, one. Good. Has our contact arrived yet? No, oh, ma'am. Nothing on our sensors at the moment. This is the right place and time. Maybe they got held up? Man, we're detecting an unknown signature on an intercept course. Hmm? Raise shields. Shields raised, ma'am. Science officer, what can you tell me about the signal? Alien vessel, ma'am. Unknown make and design. Might be shielded, but at this point we can't tell. Hmm. Power weapons, we're going in. Ma'am? If we can disable it, we can study this phase of vessel. Maybe we'll have some interesting tech we can use. Besides, we have time to it. We have time to kill. Fire one ready. Yes, ma'am. Firing at will. Oh my god, is there like a full- Oh, I love it! Oh, I love this! There's a fucking ship battle! Matt- Okay. Alright. One moment, I need to- the cruiser has stats! I love it! And also, holy shit, we took a lot of damage, fuck. Oh, dude. Okay, okay, support skills. Emergency repair, power to shield. Let's, uh, let's get some of these damages repaired. Okay, yep, okay, we're- I'm just gonna focus on powering our shields then. Because that is clearly not going to pull- Ow! Fuck. Yeah, we are not winning this one. Holy shit. Okay, target their weapons, maybe. Yep, nope, that. Can't be cruiser was defeated. Hull breach is on deck 4 through 7. Shields are offline. Weapons are operable. We're losing light support. Ugh. That's it. End the simulation. I mean, why did you attack the alien ship? You knew nothing about them, and yet you attacked right away. We weren't getting any readings from them, and they were coming for it right for us. Of course we had to defend ourselves. We didn't even try to hail them or anything else for that matter. If you had, you might have found out that you were outclassed. That's... I mean, you need to understand that a fight should not be the first solution you come up with. We're the Empire, f Empire fighting their way of life. Enough. You only get yourself and your crew killed if you go in guns blazing every time. Until you learn that, you won't progress as an officer of the Empire. It's messed. This is kind of ironic considering I spent at least the majority of the of the of the first mission trying my hardest to go stealth. What's he so angry about? The Empire has always just crushed any resistance we came across. What's wrong with asserting our authority? Sure, that ship in the simulation was pretty tough to deal with. 
That's all because of those programs to be so strong. We crushed every other civilization we came across. Emergency crew to transport to transporters. Ah, bad, bad, bad. I can't speak. The emergency crew to transport to room two seven D immediately. Prepare for the receive wounded. Emergency. That's rare. Wonder what's going on. Out of the way. Oh fuck. Medics are all here. Looks serious. Trying to receive transport. Commencing transport in three, two, one. Transport. Gene. Just please stand back and let the medics do their job. Will they be okay? Take to the med bay right away, so please clear the area. There will be more coming soon. All non-essential personnel, report to your nearest briefing room. It's an important announcement from Mad Admiral DeSangro. Go. We'll take care of your friend here. Alright. Take care of her, okay? Beginning announcement. This, this is Admiral Cantina DeSangro of the Ascension Fleet. That sounds a little too much like Mass Effect. The Ascension Fleet, I mean. I maybe I'm thinking I may be thinking about too much that that remind me immediately of Mass Effect. Okay. Anyway. Admiral Cantina de Sangro, the Ascension Fleet. As some of you may know, the Mapotahu was set recently to stat bleh, was dispatched to the Kepler system in search of new resources for the Empire. We lost contact with them about a month ago and dispatched the frigate Koya in last week to see what happened. Today the Koya returned. The Mapotahu has been destroyed. Of course not. Why would you have? It's not like it's one of your favorite games. According to the ship logs recovered in the, in the Koya, the Mapotahu had encountered another Type 2 civilization, at least as advanced as we are. The alien civilization, called themselves the United Bunny Federation, has an outpost in the Kepler system. They did not take kindly to our intrusion. The Mapatahu fought well, but it was eventually overcome. Kaya barely managed to jump out after taking heavy damage. The survivors are being treated as we speak. Citizens of the Empire, we are now in a state of war. Emperor Wilhelm von Jurgen has declared that we will not let this insult go, un go unpunished. This is our first in time encountering a civilization with two more capabilities to us. The Empire will be mobilizing in full. All military personnel who have finished their academy training will be sent to battle. Relevant personnel will receive their assignments shortly. Report to your stations in, by the time indicated. That is all. Glory to the Empire. More, huh? Wait, the Admiral said all military personnel. Does that mean mom and dad? I should hurry home. About time we get some action. Picking on primitive civilizations can get boring quick. Hopefully this Federation will put up more of a fight. I'm worried, but at the same time, I'm also a bit excited. I wonder what will happen. Where do you think they'll put us? I don't know. You're a lieutenant, and I'm just a nurse. And at the very least, I hope they put us on the same ship. Don't worry. I'm sure they will. I heard tales of the last war from my parents. Apparently it was pretty straightforward and took them, took them out easily. Hope this time will be the same. I fought in the last war, but now I'm retired. I'll probably be called out of retirement soon. Do your duty to the Empire. That's what they say, isn't it? Can I interrupt with this? Damn it. Uh... Yep, other side. Just bad. <laughs> oh! Yep, that. Yeah, that. I'm. <laughs> that was just kind of funny. <laughs> I was just trying to see if I can interrupt. Oh, wow, that's from y'all. I was trying to see if I can interrupt of it, and then, boom, okay, I'm in the air. <laughs> I'll probably get my assignments. I'm trying to enjoy the piece before it on. 
and speak to the devil. I shouldn't have jumped to uh, I guess I should be going. Okay, she just walked through me. That's that's cool. Uh, I guess she has like a set path. Hmm. Probably have it like back in or just have a, diff a different set path for like if you're in that position. Because I, I was apparently in her way. But she would just walk right through me. I wonder if we get more paid more during wartime. Uh, if so, I'm definitely going to get going to get more snacks. Um, Abel's here, and no reason to bother them. Sitting around lately, yes. Putting up that color, dear. Just because you haven't worn the uniform in a long time doesn't mean you should look can look sloppy. Mom, Dad. Uniforms. Welcome home, honey. You never thought that your mom would be a marine, did you? No, I knew you were one before, but... It's what it looks like, Kimi. You've been called back to duty. But aren't you retired? Why suddenly... You need experienced soldiers, Kimi. It's been too long since the last serious war. All the new commanders are soft. I'm not allowed to... And I'm not allowed to let your... About to let your father go off on his own. Someone has to watch his back. More importantly, what about you, Kimi? Did you get your assignment yet? I got it just now. It says I've been assigned to the Agadashi as, deck as a deck officer. And I leave tomorrow. The Agadashi, huh? I know that ship. It's a support cruiser, primarily used for resupplying the ships. You should be relatively safe. What about you two? Will you be okay? Don't worry about us, honey. I've been doing this since before you were born. You just focus on your training, okay? Maybe you'll, re you'll be resupplying our ship someday. You have to go now, Kiwi. Be good, stay safe, okay? Make us proud. Okay, good luck. I hope they'll be okay. I guess all it's left to do is wait. Bedroom. Bedroom. Is there anything more in here? I wouldn't have forgotten about the MRE if I left it in here again, would I? Aha! Quality! Really? War! What is it good for? After an unprovoked attack on the cruiser Maputohu, Emperor Wilhelm, Vil Wilhelm von Jurgen has declared war on the United Bunny Federation. The full might of the Empire has been mobilized to crush the enemy. It is only a matter of time before victory is ours. Also, I have a message on Discord, but I can't look because I have to do this because I have to use display instead of an actual like regular screen share, which sucks. But oh well. So like, let me. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Ah yeah, well. I'll check it later. Let's head in the bed. Fuck. Anything in here? Nope. Table? No. Place the lucky money off under my pillow. I should I think I should leave it this time. I have a feeling this won't be like the other battles we've fought so far. Okay. Time to turn in for tonight? Yes. A long day tomorrow. Next day. Inside Kimi, Kimi reporting for transport to GFE Agad Agadashi. Understood, Ensign. Step onto the transport pad. Transporting in three, two, one. Ensign Kimi, welcome aboard the Agadashi. You should force, first report to Captain Ro Romer on the ship, on the bridge. But familiarize yourself with the ship layout when you get the chance. How do I get to the bridge? Head outside and turn left at the corridor. Yeah, it's a lift that'll take you there. Got it. Thanks. Okay. Also... Transporter room. Oh, okay. Reduce the empire. Storage, bed bay. Deck B. Central elevator, med bay. Crew bunk A, crew bunk B. Okay. 
I mean, the layout's not too bad. It's a little awkward, but I've seen worse. Chief Medical Officer aboard the Agadashi. If you'd like, you can buy some medical supplies from me. Of course, if you get hurt on duty, we'll treat you. These are just extras for your own needs of mine. You need to buy medical supplies? Let's see. MREs and stuff. Okay, so this is all stuff I've had already in the past. Oh, so. Wait. So, where does this lead? Oh, it's a storage room. Okay, I'm selling these supplies. Locker with some weapons. Makes sense. God damn it. No crewmates in here. Or in here. So, let's head this way. Please enter your destination. The bridge. Actually, let's have the engineering first. Or was that where I just was? Definitely not where I just was. Our levels are at full. We have plenty in reserve. If the system needs extra power, we'll be ready. All power distribution is controlled. There are a lot of buttons. More advanced functions of engineering are here. Uh, of course, I'm not trained to operate. Everything looks good. Let's make sure it stays that way. Holographic representation of the ship's various systems. Looks like everything is running perfectly. A little steady. We have plenty for our mission. Our crew can take over post. Okay. Controls for the jump drive. Not trained to operate, so I should probably not touch the damn thing. Ah, yes, the battle bridge. In case anything ever happens to our primary bridge, this operates the backup control. Have the backup control room. That's actually pretty fucking rad. That, that's cool. I, I like that. Like having like a separate bridge in case someone fucks up the main bridge. Can I interact with any of this? No, not really. Okay. To your destination. Let's head to the cargo hold. Maybe there's some cargo we need to pick up, you know? Got plenty of supplies. Hello, person. I'm sure, we have plenty of supplies for a trip. You do not want to end up stuck in space with no fuel and no food. Of course. Got probe here. Make sure these probes are fueled at all times. Might save our lives one day. Airlock double doubles as a launcher for the beacon probes. Cargo bay controls everything from magnetizing the floor to opening the airlocks. I would assume magnetizing the floor would keep like the cargo, but the um the crates in set in check. Controls for cargo transporter. Okay, it's down here. Marine barracks. Been on playing missions before. This one would be a cakewalk. I almost wish they put me on a soft ship, a soft ship or ship or something. <sighs> we should be stationed on the Barry Ascension instead. At the very least, I wish I could have brought my books. Gotta make sure I have everything before we leave. <sighs> <sighs> Sorry, I didn't get much sleep last night, I guess. Once we do, I don't think we'll be back for a few weeks at least. And you! First time on an official mission. I wonder what it'll be like. Probably full of death, considering we're at war, so. Too safe, too harsh? Probably too harsh. That's bridge. Inside Kimi reporting for duty, Captain Romer. Good, you're the last officer. Your station is the science station to your right. Take your post and we'll, de and we'll depart soon. Um, what's our mission, sir? Well, I'll make an announcement while we're away. Yes, sir. Understood. Looks like this is my station. Not exactly science-minded, but the job is more like a radar station than actual science. I'm sure I can do it. Are you ready, Enzyme? Yep. Tom, single berry sentient that we are departing. Yes, sir. You have confirmation. Clear to go. 
Helms, take us out. Bullet, head full. Yes, sir, head full. We're clear, sir. Good. All hands, this is the captain. Our mission today is simple. We are to deliver supplies to an outpost in the array system. As it turns out, the outpost is close to Federation space. Command and has decided to convert it into a staging station. The outpost itself is out of the way, so it shouldn't draw attention. And I want to keep it that way until it's ready. As such, we'll be going alone with reconstruct construction supplies and weaponry to reinforce and strengthen the outpost. All hands to your stations. We're jumping immediately. Helm, begin the jump sequence. Yes, sir. Coordinates locked in. Initiating jump. Jump in three, two, one. Jumping. That is an interesting jump sound. Um, I need to check something real quick. I apologize. I just want to, like, because that's bothering me and distracting me. Outpost. Tell them we're here with the supplies. Yes, sir. This is the GFE Adachi. Ad not Adachi. What the hell am I saying? Agadashi. We heard from Fleet Ascension with construction supplies and materials. We're not getting a response, sir. Not. Scan the plans for sign of trouble. Y y yes, sir. The outpost is still there, but it appears that it will be a large sandstorm, sandstorm in the area. Yeah, it might be interfering with communications. Let's see. Helm, take us down. We're here to provide support anyway. Yes, sir. Sir, I'm detecting weapons fired on the plant, plant surface. Shields up. Power to weapons. We're approaching the outpost now. The outpost is under attack. I'm detecting an alien ship holding position nearby and multiple ground units. What are its capabilities? It's a Corvette-style ship. Corvette-sized ship, and it has low, low power signature. It should be no match for us. Lock weapons and fire at will. Destroy it. Yes, sir. Firing at will. <laughs> They're destroyed, sir. Engage the ground troops, but don't risk hitting the outpost. Yes, the surviving enemy troops are fleeing into the outpost. I don't think we engaged him directly, sir. Not with the ship, no. Helm, land us near the outpost. Consign Kimi, take some marines, and clear the outpost of hostiles. Me, sir? I'm told you're better suited for battlefield command than me, instead of being a deck officer. Besides, you ever saw officers are needed here. Yes, sir. Okay. Cargo hold. At least I assume we should head down to the cargo hold. Couple Muller reporting, ma'am. Private first class full f Fux? Is her name Fux? I'm gonna go ahead and assume that her name's Fux. That's that's just great. We're assigned to you for this away mission. Good. We don't have time to waste. Let's move. Yes, ma'am. Okay. So I guess we would have to, have to go through the transporter, wouldn't we? Fush, okay. Maybe. <laughs> now, well, now I'm not so sure. For all I know, it could be it could be private Fux. That's not the best idea, but if there's an emergency, we can teleport you back. It's not as safe as pad the pad teleportion, but still. Fush? Fuge? Hmm. How would I actually exit though? I am severely tough at the Okay, so these are all like the crew bay. 
there's a new option on the elevator. Well, it has to be shut down on the cargo hold. Maybe, um, because the air, because the, um, there's the deployment thing down here. Yeah, here we are. Oh, there's a ladder here now. Energy ladder leading up the engineer deck. Airlock, the little launcher, probe beacon. This. Ramp's raised, so I can't leave. Okay. So let me actually look at our team. Heavy rifle, and it's slightly worse. It's slightly better down here. No, it's not a more than Oh, they are significantly more leveled. Explosive shot. I doubt I can, like, take the fucking cargo transport. Console at the bottom. Uh-oh. Drills for a cargo ramp. I'll lower it so we can just... Okay. I feel a little silly now. Ready to go, ma'am? Yeah. No time for wa to waste. Let's do this. South post is just ahead. Let's go. And avoid the swamp. I don't like how it smells. The way it looks is just fucking breathing poison. A little hole here. I wonder if there's anything inside. Let's see. Stimulant and energy drink. A note with it too. Apparently this is meant to be emergency cash in case something happens. No, I'd say this definitely counts. Broken pillar damage is very recent. Actually, it looks, those look less like pillars, and may, maybe it's because of the lighting, because the lighting's a little weird here. Looks more like darkish, like a red-brown sort of look. The pillars look like boxes, like really busted up boxes. That's an enemy, I'm assuming. Let's go ahead and sneak on by. This is not the path of sneaking. Okay, guess we're fucking fighting. Time to fight. Oh, these models are different. Okay. So, I believe Kimi still has... Yep, okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and stun this mech. Just because I know if I don't, that's going to end very poorly. Stun him. Should do heat damage as well, because I got the heat sword. Oh, that crit is beautiful. he dies because I could miss. Oh, that crit. Right. Oh, I can save anywhere. Oh, okay. I, I probably should do that at some point. <laughs> I kind of do tend to forget because of the data, because of the data log things that, like the um that that stuff kind of makes me think oh I have to save at that we're using this object and then it's like nope yeah they do seem like actually really tanky it's all enemies that sounds useful plus get the quick hit in on all of them. Yeah, the officer uh, inspires confidence in her allies, raising attack and defense, and she gets a group heal. Dude, I love it. Uh, okay, yep, definitely doing that. 
Wait, is, is that only like a... Okay, so that makes it... Oh, it's all allies. Okay. So, yeah, okay. Uh, okay. Well. Um... Since we're close to killing him... Okay, just get all the shots on him. Also, I, um... I think Rapid Shot does less shots to enemies than, um... That one, so... I may have to see about that later, like... Because if... That is the case, that means Spread Shot would technically also be more powerful in, like, a single target sense if there's no enemies around. Which, let's find out. I'm gonna find out for science. So, Sundering Strike. Rapid Shot does three hits around 180. And holy fucking shit, okay. Alright, good to know. Save. Start going for officer training, doesn't really mesh over now. Oh, so like the per okay, so that's um that's interesting. So like this technically t like I guess Kimi in this sense counts as a different character class of sorts. Like she has the same she has a different class, she has a different model, she has a um different parameters as well, I noticed, like slightly higher. Which I guess parameters are like the actual stats. So, yeah. I don't know if this counts as, like, a different character, like, in terms of, like, actual, like, stats and such, but, you know. Figure it out later, I guess. I don't know. Actually, I should probably heal her real quick. up here? Oh, I can. Uh, okay, then. So, another weird thing. Moving to the left and right on this does not really work. But moving down does not actually send you back. Okay. That's weird. So, I guess you have to, like, move onto a specific space, and that is how you move between locations. I you covered it. Door's locked. I need an ID card. Well, shit. How about... Oh, that's even more of them. Okay. Okay, let's just go ahead and uh, stun. Um. Stun worked out nicely. Okay, Jesus Christ, Kimi, you are really low on health already. First aid. Just big shot. And next one. Done him again, real quick. I don't want to have to deal with the next, like, busted stuff going on. Uh, 
that's a cool animation. Try and like reduce their damage output as much as I can. Okay, big damage buff, big defense buff, always a good thing. God damn it, missed. Okay, they're both unstunned. Okay, that's uh I will re-stun the mech. Cause I know that if I le let him do whatever he wants, he's going to destroy me. That is big damage. So I feel like Molar has a I and having not looked I'm gonna check out the status real quick. Is more of like a high crit chance? No, not really. They have equal stats actually. Yeah. Interesting. Maybe they're like the same. Okay, yeah, they're the same class. I guess it's like a class based stat system, so yeah. I'll save that for later. I'm gonna right now with the heal. Since Kimi has like the big energy pool, it feels like she's really good for healing and support and such, so. Which makes sense considering she takes a leader role in terms of actual roles in the story, so. Nice. That does an insane amount of damage. Holy shit. Okay, now let's get Sundering. Okay, that was a good hit. Level 11, level 11, level 11. In here. Ken. And oh shit. Interesting response. So they're robots? Okay. Okay. We buff them. Okay, yeah, that's a good time for me to start stunning. I actually... I did stun blade. Okay. Gotta make sure on that. There we go. And focus shot maybe should take him out? Okay, just big damage. And while he's stunned, get a peel. Okay, glad I set both of them on him. Defensive skills, I do not have any TP right now, fuck. 
then I guess I would have to stick to them. There's a catch. Eh, so much for Sundering. Sunder now? Nope. Okay, I was kind of hoping for a bit much. Because I kind of remembered just how deadly the spread shot could, uh, could have been. And then I remembered, oh yeah, it was sundered and badly damaged already, so never mind. So I think we should be able to, uh... I'll sunder him now and do a bit of damage to see how that works out. He was also inspired to attack on the I have been eating the for a lot. Stun grenade. Draw fire and draw fire. Here too. Man, we have casualties. We'll make sure we get they get the proper burial later. Oh. Not down. Sorry about that. Bit of a lot outside today. What do these new skills do? Stone grenade, frozen grenade that, pro that stuns all enemies of a low probability does no damage. Alright then. Draw fire. Draw off enemy fire onto yourself to protect you or more vulnerable allies. Okay, that seems useful. Actually, real quick, I'm just gonna... That's how my MREs used up so far. Shot multiple times. TP does not carry between battle. Okay. Yeah, but I guess it, I, it seems like it'll be kind of like a thing that... It's not exactly too bad, because it's, uh... It seems like, it, it, since it regenerates, there wouldn't really be much of a need for it to have, like, a, like, definitive item for it, I guess. Station wide alarm, came too late. Uh, journal. This entry talks about the outbreak of the war and how the Raider hopes their family will be okay. It's unfinished. Anything can we grab over here? Drinks, yes, please. Energy drink, that's always good. Good stuffs. And two MREs, perfect. And if I want to damage to go in safely. later. We had to fight first. Okay, we found survivors. And two mechs. Jesus Christ. Okay. Let's go ahead and uh, spire starting off. Uh, okay, Muller, you're going to be focusing on damaging. Press. Push. Or push. Push. I'm not sure how to pronounce that still. You're gonna draw fire. Oh, so like, okay, so there's like a variable in um, stat status longevity, I guess. Oh, that, that that buff really is helping, isn't it? Uh, still, I should probably make you look teeny a bit. Oh, 
stayed. Rabbit dog. And I think this should kill. Yep. Okay, we got a really lucky crit there. Holy shit. Either that's a crit or that's like a weakness. I'm not sure which, but I feel like it's a crit. The magic computer is this stack? Uh, okay, so it just refreshes the actual stats. Okay. It, it doesn't like st put stats on. It doesn't put stats on stats on stats. Oh, that is bad. Okay. Alright, let's just go ahead and uh, nibble on that a bit. Okay. That for our leader off the back to speed, I guess. And they're quickly taking her back down. Jesus Christ, okay. I'm glad I used that um extra heal on her. I actually Okay, I'm gonna hope that this hits. Okay, you know what? That's fine. Not a good that did. Alright. Uh. Okay, I didn't really affect anyone. But we also took down the other one, so that's fine. Okay, draw fire starting to really take a breath now. Okay, and out. Alright, I think. Yeah, I think we can do this. I think we can finish this off. Fucking just spread shot him to death. Just essentially shotgun him. It's like single target spread shot. It's essentially a shotgun, I feel like. It's right to the face. I'm inside Kimi of the GFE Ad Agadashi. Who's in command here? I am. Lieutenant Walla... 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 Hump? 
wall hop of the RA4 outpost. I heard you were coming. I just never expected to be attacked so soon after war was declared. This is the doing of the Federation then? Take a little of droids. The funny errors aren't a good, dead giveaway, I, I, and I don't know what is. What surprises is how fast they attacked. I didn't even know about the United Bunny Federation until a, fit, until a day ago. I haven't had any alien vessels until a dropship came today, so. It's like they knew about the South Coast beforehand. They're watching us well. the rest of the outpost. There's still enemies around. We need to be careful. I see. Some droids dropped, their, dropped into our warehouse. He managed to let them in before coming here. Got it. We'll take care of that. We'll need this to get it. Hey! Nice! Okay, let's go ahead and... Uh, Starting, we got attacked already. It's just the worst. Better to help. We were in serious trouble there. Fuel regulation controls just like on the ship. I bet it may have been like a first aid regulation thing. enemies. Oh, it's just two max. I can make that work. Both of them stunned. Okay, it's so like, oh, so that's like a skip move thing. Okay. Okay. I was kind of just messing around with that. I'm sorry. Uh, can I head up here? I cannot. Which makes sense. Gotta do my mission. Let's see if the ID card does the trick. Got it. And in here is whoa. So I guess we got like Okay, that's a cool looking mech. Or at the very least, a little less silly looking than the other ones. It looks more like Gundam mech than um uh mech warriors mech. Games. 
Um... I think like the game is working, but the actual thing just froze up. What the hell? Uh, okay, that's weird. I may have to restart the game. Let me see if I can fix it real quick. See, I like restarting, I'll fix it. Yeah, that's weird. I, I don't know what the deal that was. It, it was still functioning, because I could like still hear the cursor moving and all. But otherwise, it was... Just acting odd. I saved a bit. Close enough. So I can still like get into here at least. Uh, I don't think I have the um, the grenade skill anymore, which kind of sucks. Yeah, no, I don't. Ah, oh, well. Fuck. Uh, pro- uh, maybe. It's me. I think it's mainly, like, I get caught up in the game and I tend not to say- I do this pretty often where I fuck up or something messes up on my end and I forget to save. Hmm. Stretch targets and lowers its, def its defense. I'm gonna go ahead and stun one of you. Take that one of these. Basic max. I think you can make it like a separate save, but I'm not entirely sure. There's probably modifications you can, you can grab that can allow that to happen. Holy fucking shit, how did you get so low? Damage, fuck. Up. Uh, oh. Oh god, that is a sudden. A, a bit. Just, just a bit. <laughs> okay, that does not. Technically, kind of unconscious. I did kind of run into this gun's blade. Oh, wait, yeah, I did. Okay. Okay, just a little bit under level. Can I escape? I cannot. Which means we're dying today, it seems like. I'm bringing back our ally. And that's a dead molar. Oh, wait, nope, he's still surviving. Like, barely, but surviving. Okay, first. Cool. Inspire, probably. will probably do it, actually. First aid on self, and take out that toy. Because the Inspire is going to give us the defense we need to survive. I, I feel like. And that's one less enemy to worry about. Oh, that is some brutal damage on the team. Okay, now she's got like everyone buffed up in defenses. Group heal, be good. Um, rapid shot, focus shot. Yes. Okay. 
so we're down some revives, and by some I mean all. But I feel like I can get this. in the matter on that one. Quick, 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 quick. Yes! Oh, luck saves me. Oh, man, that is good. That is some good shit. Okay. Okay. Now, what I'm hoping for is to shotgun that guy to death. I, I doubt it will fully work, but if it does... Yeah, nope. Okay, that, yeah. Not inspired, not sundered. Yeah, I shouldn't have respected that that much. But, I'm gonna stun him for now. And gather up some TV. The stun did not work. Oh, God. Okay, yep. That's That seems like a good time to heal. I am in a significant pickle right now. Oh god. Like, everyone's already at low health, and I should probably not be fighting these enemies, but I did it, I think. Assuming any of these hit. Okay. Good. Nice. Okay. Being completely honest, I didn't think I was going to survive that. deal that other set of enemies. I think they're, like, down below. Okay. Actually... Okay, yeah, let's, let's stun, yeah. Stun and then buff. So we don't have, like, our big damaging attacks right now. I spent them on the last fight. Get some hits in on him, you know. Oh, that is beautiful. That crit. <laughs> a 
A crit is a beautiful thing, truly. Maybe we're going yep to it. Okay. Oh! Oh, wow. This is going nice and smoothly. Okay, you're going to damage him, and then you're going to... Not to it. Oh, uh, look at that beautiful damage. And we got him stunned and low on defense, so... Okay, it hit it. Nice. Level 12, got stun grenade, draw fire, draw fire, that was good. Make sure I fucking sit. Oh, actually, first I'm gonna go. And that does it. So I know there's like a group I can fight up here. I'm gonna take care of them as well. Get them leveled, you know what I mean? Oh, that's great. Okay. I honestly think we can just finish it, finish them up with a, cut, with a variety of attacks. Yep. Okay, we're good. Thirteen. I'll take it down to here. Okay. Gonna heal again and save. No, I don't have PTSD from the last fight. Do you think that? I'm gonna take a look at it. Okay, and mech fight. Spire.
can see it, we can like take a couple of them out of the fight for now. Oh wow, okay, that was that was way more effective than expected. Kimi's just gonna poke that. And I can have the rest of them make some big attacks on that mech. Oh, that's pretty damn good damage. Make sure he doesn't really interfere. Nope, no stun. He may be dealing with both. Yep. Oh, that is a big hit. I think I'm. Am I out of. That even. Does death count as an abnormal effect? I'm wondering. Now I'm curious and worried and, you know, the whole thing preferring not to die. Okay, oh, close the shot. Take out two birds with one stone. Okay, well, shit. Okay, Kimi's out of the fight. Meaning our major supporter is just dead. You know, I'm just gonna. I'm gonna try it anyway. It's gotta be like some way to do this. I don't think I. Cause I can't like bring them back into consciousness so far. It's like I'm out of that item. Okay, never mind. It just auto redirected it to Muller. I. Okay. A double first aid uh, crush and hopefully turn her into essentially a tank for me. Though I would like everyone to stay alive, preferably. that gives like the defensive buff but hopefully it does. Oh I got lucky. Oh that is significantly less lucky. Okay. Hopefully we should be able to finish them off. Nice. Federation has some pretty advanced tech. Oh, thank God, she's back to one health. Okay. <sighs> More energy drink. No reason to bat this one right now. I guess I should have bat to the person in the building. Now things here, good luck. Wait, was that not the Should I have done something else? Is that not the warehouse they were talking about? I don't know if they have any other warehouses. Other than a repack down here. Okay. 
Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, then. Yeah, no, you're right. I'm I'm a little dumb. Shock should work in this situation, I think. Just to just like do a bit of damage to everyone, and we hopefully weaken him enough for a shot. For, up, yep, that should weaken. Yep. Oh, damn it, it skipped the- I accidentally tapped right and it skipped the first turn. Just enough. So you think the Federation knew about this outpost before we even learned of their existence? Yes, sir. Lieutenant Wallahop thinks so, too. At the turn off after switching to different turn skipping. Yeah, that may be a good idea, because, like, I, I guess it would be, like, um, I mean, you can make it still set it so you can, like, um, go back by uh, pressing the back button or, like, the cancel button. The same way, like, you can do it by, like, um, to, like, go back to the escape menu and such like that. But I think the main issue is up oh, a moment. Sorry about that. The main issue is, like, yeah, the, the turn skipping is a little bit weird. Okay, that's still on by default. Yeah, okay. I wasn't really sure. I haven't really messed around too much with the RPG. I should probably mess around with RPG Maker more. Okay. So, it's the only explanation. How else did they know how to attack this place? And it's always possible. It's just random chance. But I'd rather not dismiss a dangerous possibility like that. No wonder so little we know about our enemy. We'll need to report this to the Admiral and High Command. If the outpost compromised. My ori our original mission might, ch might change. We might have to evacuate if the enemy comes back. Good job, Kitty. Get some rest. You earned it. Thank you, sir. And... Oh, well. Yeah, it's been a long day. I think I'll take a nap. Or maybe I'll take a walk around the ship first. Sounds like we should clear up soon. Fly back to orbit, we, but we probably shouldn't leave just yet. Communications console, pretty standard for all ships. Didn't expect to see any accident in my first, first sortie, but I have to say it was pretty exciting. Uh, this is probably. Oh, okay. So that's actually kind of cool. Okay. Bad feeling about this. Can we get out of here already? I guess I'll head down to deck B. See if I can uh, pick up some reviving items from the shop. You know. Deal, but it's better than nothing. There. 
Thanks for saving skin. Had a long day, so I'm just gonna sleep here for a bit. Oh. Say well, hello. You doing better? You doing better? I hope. Yes. Just had to get some wounds patched up, and now I'm just sleeping it off. Wish we had revived sooner, though. It's not your fault. Besides, say the rest of us. Thank you. I guess it'll be the bonus, would it? Wait, can I sleep on any of them? Oh, just... I just... I guess I just guessed the right one. Wow, I got really lucky on that one. Been looking forward to this. Chapter 3, Turning the Tide. About a year after the event on Array 4. That's a jump. Reward the United Bunny Federation has now entered its second year. Despite heavy losses, Emperor Wilhelm von Jurgen remains confident that the Empire will prevail over its enemies. In a speech last week, he said that the sacrifices we make today will pave the way to a glorious future for the Empire. We here at Imperial Fox News agree. agree. Once the Federation is defeated, there will be nothing but stopping us from taking our rightful place at the head of the galaxy. Finally, a reminder to all to register for the Imperial Census night by the end of the next month. Uh, by the end of the month, every fox has their duty to the Empire. Order to do yours. Glory to the Empire. Can you turn the TV off? Sure. How's your training going? It's over, I think. I have been serving on the Agadashi this whole time. I haven't had time for training at all. The old combat's the best training anyone can get, Kimmy. An hour on the battlefield is like a year of simulations. I know. Okay, Kimi. Yeah, I just wish Mom was still around. Me too, Kimi. Me too. Wow, that's a bomb to drop. Shit. That is, is this war even worth it? I don't know, but it's not up to us to decide. Don't give me that crap. I get enough of that from the news. I don't want my dad to repeat the same thing. Kimmy. I want to know what you, you personally, think about this war. I don't think this war should have started in the first place. I don't know how, what happened with Mapatahu, but it, I'm sure it didn't need to escalate the way it did. Thanks, Dad. Everyone keeps saying the same thing over and over, so I was scared out of the loan and thinking that the whole war, war is kind of pointless. Now I know at least you feel the same way. Just be safe out there, Kimi. I don't want to lose you to it. Don't worry, I can handle myself. I should get going. I'm due back to the ship soon. Alright. Come visit next time your ship is docked to the fleet, okay? Of course. That suddenly got kind of sad. No way I forgot food here a first time. Yup! Gosh darn it. Replicator, one of the more advanced technologies we have. Ready for use. Make something. Yes! I love it. Okay. Stimulant. Yes, please. I did not know we had this. Oh. Well, shit. Oh! The room looks nice. Trust your digital pads can give it out of date though. Should have gotten a new one before the ration started. New bed is much more comfortable. Got me some new books about marine tactics and historical battles. I've read them multiple times already. I don't 
I just make sure I have everything I need. Uh, I'm supposed to go to transporter room 3B. I think that's next to the hangar. First things first. Neighbor. I uh, hear my neighbors didn't make it. This apartment is empty now. I miss my brother. He's not dead, but he's been ordered back to the home planet. I'd visit, but I can't just sleep on post here. Classroom. I guess I can understand it, but I don't know how, I don't like how they consider decide what's considered essential and non-essential. Medicine's pretty vital to people. People ration, there's a 20% increase in price on non-essential goods. We like the breast wares? Uh okay. Fuck. Uh, passive MP regeneration. That actually sounds really useful. Uh, do I have anything I can sell? Why do I still have the axe after all these years? Seven, mo seven months and eight years and I still have a giant axe with me. Also, you'd figure I would have given this card back to, uh, Personal shield seems useful. <laughs> I guess it would be a bit of a souvenir. Mm. Oh, this is actually a tough call, because, like, okay. So the shield gives a boost to fucking. To, it gives a boost to not only defense, but also support abilities. Which is what I'm mainly using Kimi for. She's a supporter, it seems like, more than anything else. And like using Marines for more offensive stuff. But this one also gives a MP regeneration. Which isn't it which definitely isn't bad, so. Especially because that's how we use sports skills. So I'm thinking the personal shield probably would be better. If only because of the fact that it would also give her more survivability. So I will stick with that. Uh, fuck, fuck. Oh yeah, that's... Okay, that's useful. Okay. So maybe if I sell that, I would have enough, but I doubt it. Yeah, not quite. Ah, mm. oh, well. Can we get some foods? Hmm? Where's Marie? She was transferred to Feet Takwa a while back. Oh, okay. Let's go to your right. ID, please. Here you are. Let's see. Lieutenant Kimi, here's your morning ration. Enjoy. Well, that's sad shit. I actually liked Mori. She gave me free shit. Is the best time to join the academy during wartime? Of course, they're offering a bunch of benefits to new recruits right now. Besides, it's not like the cadets get set to dangerous places. I guess so. I don't want it to be explored, though. These shortcomings of the Empire are really come into focus. We have powerful fleets, but not enough farming and industrial planets to really support them in wartime. I suppose that may be the real reason for this war. Or the mission to subjugate the natives at the Billy's Delta. Well, that was the planet I went for for my first cadet mission. I'm uh, not surprised. It's a common location for training cadets. Well, it was. Now it's being converted into a farming planet for the Empire. 
Uh, until we build a proper colony there, we'll be using the natives to farm native crops. Hmm. I hate that I'm assigned to guard duty. I guess I should be thankful I wasn't that bad to the home planet. But I was trained to fight the enemy, not to be a, secu a glorified security guard. Ugh, I hate the rations. Food sucks, everything's more expensive. Uh, I guess I'll just have to barrel that until we win the war. Guess we're gonna just have to leave it. They keep they keep adding new stuff to the ship. I guess it's like to keep it from being so co too complicated or anything for like first time exploration. Like suddenly, like having a new location location of the ship is like a little jarring. I guess. I need a break. Doctor Hawkins is so jealous in his research. I get that what we're doing is extremely important, but he's a real slave driver. Control area. What's in here? Labrador, lab, laboratory 3D. Console to control the simulation. I should leave it alone. Console, though I'm not sure what it's for. These don't disturb our work. How about you? So close. I think a bit of data that the middle line will be complete. Sir, High Command has already dispatched the science vessel to consult the research you requested. We can only wait for it to return. understand how important this is. I hate to admit it, but those damn bunnies have us beat when it comes to space travel. If we're successful here, we, we can change the tide of this war. End of chapter. I understand, sir, but there's really nothing we can do until we get the data. No, we need to keep searching for another way in case the research team fails. Seems pretty serious. I should disturb them. What does this do? Displaying all sorts of data. Not that I can make sense of it. Very fox that dirt. Yep, yep, yep. Transport to room 3B. Hangar is being renovated right now. Okay. Yeah, I did mean roll credits. I'm just dumb. I mean, it would be roll. I feel, I feel like it's the it's the t it's the name of the chapter, not the name of the whole game. So I, I feel I feel like end of chapter would be like fitting enough. Trap first, step on that pad. Thank Kimi. Are you ready to go back to the Yagadashi? Yep, let's go. All right, give me a uh, lock in the coordinates. Oh wait, skip someone. Shit. Sergeant Gene reporting in. Hey! Jean, going on a mission? Kimi, I haven't seen you in a while. I'm assigned to the Agadashi. You? Me too. I'm about to head over now. Great, we can work together again. Gordon, it's locked in. Ready for transport, Lieutenant? Alright, I'll see you on board, Jean. On, on board? Why am I. Bleh, bleh, why can't I speak today? Transporting in three, two, one. Welcome back, Lieutenant. Please step off the pad. We have another person coming aboard. Got it. I like her new armor. Her new armor looks good. Sergeant Jean reporting. I'm aboard the Agadashi, Sergeant. Thank you. Where's my assignment? Marines are to stand by in the barracks for now. Go ahead and drop off your belongings. Come on, Gene. I'll show you around the ship and take you there. Sure, lead the way. And this here is your bunk. It's not much, but it's comfortable enough. 
We're on a warship, Kimi. Not a luxury cruise. This will do fine. Hmm. That's fair. Are you alright, Jean? You were out for a while after you returned from the Mapatahu mission. I haven't really had a chance to talk since then, so... It was really surprising. I never expected to run into those bunnies like that. Then again, I don't think anyone did. I'm alright now, though. Ready for action. Do you know what our mission is? The captain will make an announcement once we get underway. Speaking of which, I should probably head to my post. Alright, I'll get settled in then. Come visit any time. Sure thing. Which will be this time. Better not be a number supply run. Those are so boring. Hey, Foosh, how are you doing? Lieutenant! Everything's all set. I'm good to go. Good to hear. Hmm? Where's Muller? I heard he got recalled to the home planet. Him too, huh? So many men are being sent back. Yeah. It was a shame. I was looking forward to working with him again. Oh well. Be ready, okay? We're heading out soon. Yes, ma'am. Please stop calling me that. It makes me feel old. Sorry. The past year has been pretty eventful. I'm so glad we never ran into any difficult fights. I'm sure that's going to come become very ironic in a moment. Hearing a lot of science equipment. A science pistol was wonder why we have all this. Another cargo run, maybe? Yeah, well, let's head up to the bridge. Is that Kimi reporting with Captain Romer? Good, you're back. We're about to be underway. Take your post. Yes, sir. There we go. I can't believe I've been at the station for a whole year. Well, at least I got promoted. Are you ready to go, Lieutenant? Yep. Yes, sir. All hands, this is the captain. Our mi out mission today. Bit of a typo there. Our mission today is a dangerous one. The science ves vessel Arga Arga Argutus? Argutus? Argutus is sent, sent a while back to an important, important mission, research mission. They are currently stranded in Federation space. The last transmission they sent indicated that their jump drive was da had been damaged and they were being pursued by Federation ships. That was sent a week ago. A few days ago, a jump beacon was detected near the Arga Argutus's last known state location. Given the importance of the data they have, High Command has decided that a rescue mission is necessary. We are to, to retrieve the data they have gathered and rescue any survivors that. Uh, bleh. Sorry. Rescue any survivors if there are any. For this mission, we'll be escorted by the frigate Vat Vicinium. All hands are to maintain full alert, ready for anything. We jump as soon as we get the signal. Captain, we have the clear to go. Helm, begin jump sequence. Yes, sir. We're in a clock in. Machine jump. Jump in three, two, one. Jump in. We've arrived at our desti- Captain, there's a Federation cruiser here. Power to ship. Uh, what? What just- Everything got fucked. Oh dear. The bridge. Intruders detected on the on deck B in cargo bay. Marines to battle station. Can't stay here. Is the captain dead? The captain is not dead yet. Badly wounded but still alive. Me. Don't speak. I'll try and get help. Get to the battle bridge. Save the ship. I'm just. I can do it. Keep me. <coughs> Captain! He passed out. Okay. So I believe cargo hold is the battle bridge. Okay! Okay. Oh, that's bad. 
push. We're fighting back. Right. Did I see... I think I feel like I saw Jean on the other side, and that is a creepy robot. Cool looking though. Them. And I decided apparently to have this stuff happening. Apparently. There we go. Okay, everything's back up and running. Okay, hopefully that's the And focus shot on the droid. Oh god, yeah, that stunned everyone. I'm actually now kind of curious about what are the chances of them actually getting stunned. Because I, it has a pretty inconsistent chance, obviously. But, like, they, they say, like, a low pro... It says, like, a low probability, but... I'm not entirely sure about that. I believe this will be the second time now that I have stunned literally everything in the room. Okay. Well, I, I suppose there's nothing really to worry about now. But... Nerfing. Okay. Uh, I'm not sure. Is J you may. Uh, do you mind checking if Jay is going to be? Oh, okay. Cool. He's here. All right. Thank you. Let's go ahead and make sure you survive this. Stunned. I guess I'll be a void that isn't stunned right now. And god damn it.
think we should be able to just attack and finish this guy off. Okay. Oh, the alert's still going. Wait, what? Wait, so Jean was over there. I saw that. And now she's fucking dead. That can't have... That can't have... Are you okay, Push? My armor took a few hits, but I'm okay. I need to get to the battle bridge, but the elevator's been destroyed. We can use the access ladder to get to the engine. We can get the engineering. I'll come with you just in case we land in the more enemies. I just, I'm gonna just go head over there and... I definitely saw that this time. I know for a fact now. I just... Is that like a hint at something? Or is that like... Also, hi, Geek. How are you doing? Join us relatively attacked. Where is everyone? I think they went to the battle bridge. In case the deck officers are incapacitated, other officer officers will fill their roles. Alright, let's go there. Do I have anything I can give her? Unlikely. Lieutenant, is this everyone? Looks like the engineering is cut off from the rest of the ship. What should we do, man? Me? You're the highest ranking officer here. Alright, give me a moment. I'm scared, but we need to get going soon. I'm just an engineer, I barely know how to end. Ready? Hell no, but let's do this. Give me a status report. Not operational. In fact, most of the ship systems are online. We just took a lot of structural damage. That's one piece of good news. What about the Vecinium? Except for heavy damage, we're all still. What? The Vecinium's been destroyed. Fuck. Okay. Federation's cruiser is turning to us. Priority shields and weapons. I was kind of hoping that with that, we'd already have two buffs. But oh well. I, I guess I... That wasn't much to ask for. Let's just go ahead and beef up my shield. Just in case. Okay, glad I did that. Yeah, just target your weapons for a moment. There we go. That's going to help out a lot. Yeah, okay, so it's not like in order of allies, then enemies. It's like in order of just whoever has higher agility. Okay. That's cool. Uh, ready to go whenever? Okay, I've got a uh, seven more minutes, I believe, so. And I'm just gonna try and finish up the section if I can. But once we hit, like, uh, seven, I should be good, so. Since I can save anywhere, I should be fine. Okay, we're out of buff, so. I'm gonna also repair. That, yep, that fancy. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, try to get your weapons for now. Fire missiles on you? Oh, that's a cool animation. I love it. Does significantly more damage too. 
so I think I will finish him off here. The GFE Agadashi was victorious. Nice. Federation cruiser has been destroyed. <sighs> Candace Hector. I don't want any, any more enemies sneaking up on us. Yes, ma'am. Fush, sweep the ship. Uh, Fush, sweep the ship and make sure there's that there aren't any enemies on board. Search for survivors too and see what repairs you can do. Yes, ma'am. Contact FB. See what the situation is there. There's no response from anyone there. That's not a good sign. I'm going to take a look around the ship and think about what we should do next. Let me know if anything comes up. I won't be joining. I've got some food to eat, and I've also got to lay down for a little bit. I am weirdly tired tonight. Huh. Okay. Stun grenade. This will help out. Perfect. If I do, if I may actually message you, Sophia, because I may see, I, I may have some ideas for you. Like my, minor balance and stuff. That's about all. That's just about it. Could could be. Good kill. Yep. Okay. Except, never mind. All right, thanks, game. All right, once this battle is finished up, I think I will swap over to Jay because it is getting to be around that time where we swap in and out. Jay, I believe, will be playing Sly Cooper 4. Which I've heard good things about Sly, Sly Cooper. I've never played it personally myself. But, you know, I, I think it's good. I, I've heard good things, at the very least. I think, uh, I think that should do it. Use all of the team. Awesome. Lovely. Perfect. Last of them. And... Okay, so for now, uh, Jay, you get to go. Okay, so I actually, I think Jay said, yeah, he said he's good to go, whatever. So I think he should be good now. So this has been a Space Fox Kimi. You can get it on, I believe it's, I believe it should be coming to Steam soon. But um, Shenzu, I'd put this game onto uh, what was it, Ichio? I'm trying, I'm trying to remember like specifically, but I, but I am dumb and I don't remember these things, so let me try and remember.
Well, I think I should be fine. I think... Yeah, itchy. Oh, okay. Alright, anyway. That will be it from me. Coming up next is Jay playing Slide 4. Enjoy.